you on my channel. <laughs> Hello guys. Sorry I didn't do a Sunday vlog. I'm sorry I haven't really been into making videos. I have been busy with family issues here at my house and health issues and other things. Um, I'm not going to lie to you guys, but I have been, my body has been drained of energy and I've been so want to just lay in bed, watch TV, and I get like five or ten minutes into a show and I'm out snoring TV since the basement. Um, I have found out a lot of things about me recently that's kind of scary and I will be getting checked out. Um, I told y'all I was supposed to go into the hospital on Thursday, but the plans changed. It's not going to be until Saturday now. Um, besides my husband's schedule changing, uh, the doctor has said, can I come in Saturday instead of Thursday? Because something, he had something he had to do, and so we changed it Saturday to do all my tests and get my stuff together and ran. Um, I would, this morning, uh, my blood pressure was low. My blood pressure was low yesterday morning. Um, this morning, this arm was hurting and I felt a little lightheaded and dizzy. My husband almost did not go to work. He was going to stay home just to check on me, but he has been texting and checking up on me to see how I'm doing. My last checkup I gave him, I'm fine. He got a list of stuff I wanted him to bring home. Uh, I do want to cook dinner, but I asked him to bring some box, something he already made that I can just pop in the toaster oven to cook. So, for that reason. Um... Friday, we are going to go to Kroger's and pick up a few things. Um, I told him I wanted some Hot Pockets again. I said, I want Hot Pockets again. And he said, Hot Pockets? I said, yeah, because if we have to go to the hospital and I have to have tests run, I want to get up in the morning, like I normally do at 6 something, pop a Hot Pocket in the, in the microwave, cook it, and be able to eat it. And I want to be able to have something to eat. You know, that morning when I take, because I have a pill that I have to take, and I have to take it with food, and he understands, and I was like, I don't really want to cook nothing, I just want some fast food in a hurry, and of course have water and whatnot, and then I text him to pick up some milk, some sugar, two box meals, water, and I was going to ask him to pick up some cream sauce, because I have some spaghetti noodles, and I can make that with cream sauce and have it for me for lunches to eat but then I decided I'll wait and I'll pick up cream sauce Friday when we go to Kroger's I'll pick me up some cream sauce I let them know I'm buying cream sauce to go with the spaghetti noodles to be able to eat that um I still have macaroni and cheese in the refrigerator which I'm probably going to pooch out because it's probably going bad so I'll probably throw that out um, I threw the mac and cheese and chicken out that I made for my husband. He told me to pitch it, throw it out, and I did not. Um, told me to clean out the deep, not deep, deep, well, in the deep freezer, he told me to take the ice chest out that I have ice in it for my best friend and I when we go swimming. He said, get that out of the deep freezer. And I did that as well. And He said, we'll figure something out. Just take that out. And I did. And it's sitting outside on the back porch and whatnot so that is that of course in our big deep freezer we have a bag of ice and we have ice packs and we got a thing of dry ice in there i think it's dry ice i'm not for sure but we also got water bottles in there i filled up jug milk jugs and water bottles and put them in the deep freezer so we have them if we have we're under hurricane warning seasons or whatever. If we have a bad storm, we can go out in the deep freezer and we can grab one of those and let it sit and thaw out and we have water. 
And if they're sitting there, so it's going to be pretty good while it's frozen, so it'll be like frozen water, but it's good. Um, I fill up, was filling up milk jugs and filling up, you know, refilling water bottles and putting them in the fridge. And like I told my husband, I said, I need to quit throwing the water bottles. When I drink a water bottle, I need to quit throwing them in the trash. I need to fill them up. So we can have them with sink water and fill it up. I was filling them up when we had an ice maker and water. I was filling them up that way. But then I quit when I saw the goop coming out of it. And we got rid of it pretty good because it went out. But um, got rid of that. And I started filling them up with sink water. Taking the sink water and putting it in there. And then... Another thing, um, my husband and I, we were sitting here talking about, um, my husband likes to watch the TV show, um, prepar pop preparation or something like that. They're preparing for, like, a zombie attack or something seriously happen for, like, us, as my husband says. Um, I am prepared for a hurricane and we need this so he says we won't need the deep freezer in the backyard we can unplug that one we won't need it we just need a smaller deep freezer so I went on Walmart's website because he works at Walmart and I found a couple of them that are pretty cheap pretty good they're both black and I'm going to let him know that this would be perfect for us and it comes with a little cute little basket inside, which is awesome. And I was like, this would be perfect for us to put food that we need in here and here. Now, meal preparation stuff for meals. I want to start making crock pot meals. Um, I have a friend. Um, if you do not have not watched their channel, I'll try to link them down below. Um, it's our life. Um, their Kindle is awesome. Daniel is awesome. The kids are awesome. The kids are in cheer. Um, she makes a lot of crock pot meals. And preparing a crock pot meal and eating it that night and then taking what is left and put it in the deep, put it, I want to say deep, put it in the freezer. For another day to eat is something I want to do. And I want to talk to, of course, my husband about it and see what he thinks if I should do this or not. Make crock pot meals. Eat it the first night. The second night, take it, put it up, and freeze what we have and just have it one night. But if he wants to have it for two nights, we can have it for two nights. I used to make beans, sausage, and cornbread. And do that. And I told my husband I would not mind making the beans and sausage again. Because I need the fiber. My doctor said I need fiber. But I don't know if I really want to make that again. I'm not for sure. I know now I have um, I think four bags of brown rice in the pantry. I have some, some um, pasta in the pantry. And... Um, I was talking to my husband about buying a pantry that I saw on, I think it was on Walmart that I seen the pantry was on, at Walmart, I believe it was on Walmart's website, it might have been on Amazon, but I think it was on Walmart's website, I'll have to look again, but I thought about buying one and putting it in this room, so I could start putting my pantry foods in here. Sorry, my nose is putting my foods, like my boxes of mac and cheese or my cups of ramen noodle soup and other things I like to eat, take and put in here as well because I think it would be the best thing to do. Have it in here, have it ready, and go. When I was looking at my computer, my coffee stuff was there, and I was looking for it this morning, because I couldn't, it was going to make me a cup of coffee. 
I started drinking coffee in the morning. I hate coffee with a passion. I do not like coffee. Mostly I like, we'll drink it every once in a while, one at a time, but I don't really care too much for coffee, but, <laughs> but I've been drinking it. Drinking a cup of coffee and watching a good movie on YouTube. That's my jam in the morning. When I get up in the morning, the first thing I do, I get up, I go make a, a pot of coffee for my husband. Whatever I'm going to eat for breakfast, I get it cooking, toaster oven, microwave, whatever. Come in here, grab whatever day it is on this thing, pop it open, take my pill with my water, sit down, bing, then I go get my breakfast. I come in here, I set my breakfast here, because in front of me I check my blood pressure, and then I'll grab my my dinner and my lunch, or excuse me, my breakfast and eat my breakfast. I usually eat my breakfast here, and I usually eat dinner at my computer, but lunch, I'm usually eating it in there watching TV. And there has been times after I've had something for lunch, I decide I want to eat something different, like other things. Now, whew, trying to be healthy, trying to stay alive, it's hard. Um, just keep praying for me, and hopefully things will turn out right. My leg's not hurting as bad as it was before. But it does hurt to stand on it for a very long time. Um, that's why I sit or I lay. Um, I've been lazy a lot lately. Well, of course, since I found out I can't stand on my legs very long, I do become lazy with my dog. I was wondering where she was at. But other than that, things have been pretty good. I hope you enjoy this video. If you do, give it a thumbs up. And please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I will give you more updates. Um, I am going with a friend of mine tomorrow to the library. So I'll probably be doing a book haul tomorrow. Um, I've got a couple books right now. I'll go ahead and show you. My husband bought me a couple books. He bought me this book here. Um, and he bought me this book here. So this is a small book, huh? Just two books, which is okay. He thought I would enjoy these books. Um, and he even, well, I wrote my name on the bottom there, but I enjoy what he buys me. And what was good about this book is he saw it on my Facebook books that I wanted and he saw that it was the last one at Walmart and picked it up for me. So. Which is okay. I don't mind. I hope you enjoy it. Until next time, bye guys. I will keep you updated if anything else changes. And until next time, bye guys. Excuse me.